We're going to walk you through the JNL oil separator installation for your 5 liter F-150. Including the JNL kit is a fully assembled oil separator with quick connect fittings, a mounting hardware, a mounting bracket. The tools you'll need for installation is a 10 millimeter socket, extension, a ratchet, a 10 millimeter wrench, a Phillips head screwdriver, a sharpie or a ballpoint pen, and a drill with a quarter inch drill bit. Let's get started. Our first step, we need to remove our factory PCB line, which is on the passenger side valve cover at the PCB valve, hooking up to the intake manifold. There's a tab on the back side of the connection, I'll show you. But you just pull the tab away from the fitting and pull up. This is the tab. Just pull that away. Our matting location for our bracket is here on the battery tray. You'll notice that there is a push pin holding a wiring harness here. We're going to pull that push pin out. You could do that with a clip removal tool or if you give it a good wiggle here with your hands, you could usually pull it right out. Now this is a 2021 F-150. You'll notice that the battery tray on the 21 and ups is at a 45 degree angle versus earlier trucks is at a 90. On these 21 and ups, we're going to use the bolt and the nylon lock nut. So we're going to put that bolt through that hole and then we're going to get our nut started on the back end of it. And then we need to use our wrench and our socket and extension. And we're going to just snug that up for now. And I'm not going to tighten that all the way down yet because we need to mark our next hole to be drilled. So now you're going to want to grab your Sharpie or a marker. I'm going to square this bracket up and I'm going to make a mark. And where I want that hole, slide the bracket out of the way. Grab your drill. And get right in your mark there. Drills right through. And we're gonna grab our other bolt. Slide that through. And once that one's tight, go ahead and finish tightening up your first one. Now we're going to grab our oil separator. We're going to align the two logos and use the supplied machine screws to mount the oil separator to the bracket. So on these five liter trucks, you're going to notice the hoses are going to seem pretty long. Um, this kit fits many different F-150s and you 5 liter owners don't have an engine cover to worry about. So we're going to use up the slack in these hoses very strategically. Um, our first thing I want you to know is that all of these hoses can move on the fittings for adjustment and that's going to help you significantly in the routing of the hose. These quick connect fittings twist 360 degrees completely around. You just grab them and twist them. They might be stiff to break free initially but they will break free. So first one, uh, the easy one, intake fitting. We're gonna plug right on to the fitting here. Notice our hose, we don't want any kink. So if your line's like this, you know, that would work, just not the most attractive thing. If you twist it around this way, you know, you just gotta kinda play with it. I like to route the hose more towards the front of the truck because I feel like it eats up the slack. And then for our hose to our PCV, we are going to actually route this through this harness here. This is the computer for the truck. So I'm gonna grab my quick connect fitting and come through and pull 
my slack through and I'm going to loop around and again if my fitting was facing this way don't twist your hose and twist it on twist your fitting take the stress out of the line and that's going to plug right onto there we got a nice loop down and around onto the PCV connection our fittings disconnect a little differently. You'll notice that there is a green button. Sometimes they're gray also. It says push on it. You just push that button and pull up on the fitting. Do not remove these clips. You will break them, I promise. To reinstall, just snap right down into place. Very, very simple. I'll give you a, a close up here of the line routing. Go down in our PCB, down through this hole, back and around. to our intake. Pretty simple installation. Check your oil separator after a thousand miles of driving after install. You can use our uh, little reminder stickers or set a reminder in your phone. And your average collection on most of these five liters about an ounce of oil every uh, thousand miles. The can holds three ounces in its default form. We do have an optional extension that is compatible with this that will double the capacity of your oil separator, which is very convenient for people that live in cold climates because you will see some condensation or moisture buildup in the cans uh, in the colder months. So uh, if you have any questions, please reach out and we'll see you on the next one.